and welcome back to Swans Talk TV. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about a teeny bit of contract news regarding Ben Cabango. And also, I'm going to be talking about the most consistent uh, player in the Swansea squad, Andre Ayer. I'm going to be talking about his um, how well he's done so far in the season, as well as stats. And will he sign a new contract? Because we haven't yet heard heard of him sign a new contract so hopefully he does before i start the video subscribe turn on the post notifications and hit the like button you know the score you know what to do let's get this video up to 10 likes if you like and let's get uh, my subscribers up to 105 by the end of the week which would be nice as well so like i said if you do like the content and uh in this video and in the channel subscribe so We'll start with a bit of the contract news. Um, as I said, so Ben Cabango, he has signed a new contract because his contract was running out. Well, ha is going to be is going to run out. Um, I think it was at the end of um, the 2022 to 23 season or this season probably. But he's signing a new contract till the summer of 2025, which is very good because he was a very vital player when. Ryan Bennett, as you all know, did have a calf knock. And he was very good uh, when it came to replacing him uh, because he did, you know, help us quite a lot with, um, you know, trying to intercept uh, certain chances from the opposition, which were lethal, which were, which were very dangerous. And he, uh, you know, he's a very good player indeed. So, um, um, so that is pretty much, that's pretty poor for the contract news. But there's nothing more going on apart from most... Uh, Swansea players being called up and other other players in different um, teams being called up for the international for international duty. So all good luck to them. Um, you know Wales uh, Wales did play against Belgium. They did lose three one. It was a bit of a disappointing result, but you know we can do better than we can. You know improve, um, which is the, the whole part of playing football. But we'll get on to Andre Ayew now, and. Andre Ayew has been probably one of the most consistent players in the squad, having given us seven points, I, be I believe, in um, in games where we've not been uh, our best form. And he's a very lethal and very dangerous player indeed. And he does give us that sort of edge um, that we really do need when it comes to uh, certain chances with the ball. His ball mastering, his dribbling is absolutely excellent, um, in my opinion. He's got 14 goals and two assists. The assist thing, you know, isn't the best, but we can't really have a go at him because he's good. Like I said, he's given us seven points. Um, he's given seven points, which has put us now third in the table when we were like 15th or 16th. Um, at the start of the season, so he has been a major impact in the club. And Jamal Lowe, he sort of replaced Jamal Lowe because Jamal Lowe, as you all know, has not been very consistent. His goal drought does continue, which is a very big concern. Um, and, you know, he has uh, replaced him. But at the same time, we hope that Jamal and Andre can become... We can, can come back to pay as a duo because they are very good. One has the speed, one has the dribbling and the ball mastery. So it's 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 a very disappoint it's a very disappointing issue uh, for Jamal Lowe, but hopefully he can come back and and you know prove to himself that he is um, the right player for the for the club. Um, but we'll we'll talk more into his contract. Um, you know we haven't heard much of um contract news regarding. Him. I would love if he does sign a new contract. I would love it if he does because he is. A very good player for us, and he has been a very good player. He's been very efficient when it comes to a uh, starting, and he's he's a very efficient player. Um, he's very good when it comes to uh, awareness um, in certain in certain parts of the pitch. And we hope he does sign a new contract because it is very important for the club to know that we have got a player that is performing to um, you know. A, a, play this performance to their highest standards and that is what Andre Ayew is doing um, and to rectify the situation we know that if we have him if we have him in the club we know that he's gonna make 
the team much more positive because the team has been down in the last couple of games because we have been losing um quite a lot of games so he ha he can rectify the situation quite quickly which we do all need definitely as a whole but you know put um but put down your com comment down below sorry um whether you think Andre I will stay at the club um or not I do believe that he will stay at the club because he loves Swansea I I believe and Swansea love him as well so you know, vice versa. But like I said, drop your comments down below. Whenever you think Andre, I should stay with us um, for the future, or whenever you shouldn't, whenever you don't think you should stay with us. Um, but apart from that, thanks for watching. I'm going not. I'm not going to be doing a video tomorrow or, or over the weekend. But I will be doing a video, a couple of videos next week that I will be. Um, I will be thinking of what to do. But before then, thanks for watching. Um, have a good rest of your week. And come on the Jack Army. <laughs>